Hey YouTube! Uh, welcome to Blog 9 or Vlog 9 or Bog 9, I don't know. To my schoolie project. Um, it's been a while, so I'm going to give you a quick update of what I've done. Uh, I'll list it as fast as I can so that I can move it along and I'll show you pictures along the way as I'm speaking. Um, I have painted most of the exterior of the bus except for the nose and the rear. Uh, it's a shitty job right now, but I did that and the roof, so I'm pretty set on that. Uh, I have removed the lights in the front and patched those with metal sheeting. It's not the greatest, but it'll do the job, and then I just, you know, silicone that shut. Um, I have taken out the floor completely. I, uh, I went ahead and I um, got rid of all the rust. I converted it, and then I fiberglassed it and painted over the floor. After I painted over the floor, I squared out my floor. Um, basically, it's every four feet or so. Uh, I made a mistake. I did, I did 48 inches instead of 47 inches. You do 47 inches so that you have a half inch on either side of your 2x2, two two, which you're using the frame, to drill into. Uh, I didn't do that. I did four feet because I wasn't thinking. And I had to make some altercations. And I've made my floor a little bit differently. But it, it's kind of like a threshold to where my bed's going to end. It works out in a way of way. Um, I had put this loop, this, which is R3, and it's a half inch Pink Panther. Um, it's a vapor barrier, and it's decent. I put this on the bottom, and then I put Mansville uh, foil, one inch foam, and I put that on the uh, on top of that. That's us. Uh, R6, so it's R9 on the floor, then I took the same combination, put it on the windows, or the sidewalls, and then I great foamed it in, so I have R9 on the sidewalls, and I'm going to do this, where I put the uh, Pink Panther R3 up, and then I'm going to take this uh, premium duct insulation, which is just insulation, uh, it has a foiling on it too, this is R6 plus R3, so this is going to be R9, all I have to do is um, sand these down and then I can put them in and I won't have any issues. Once that's all done, I'm going to build a bed um, right here. I'm going to build it this way and I'm going to also probably have this probably where my water is going to be situated and this is where I'm going to most likely uh, have my potable water uh, right underneath my bed. And that's all because, and this is the, the, the fun part, um, I'm going to be moving in here in 30 days, which is not optimal, but if I can uh, survive a night in here, which is what I'm planning to do, is once I get the bed platform built, um, I'm going to sleep on it, you know, with my little butter heater, see how it is, and if I can uh, handle it and I'm comfortable, uh, hell, if I can do it without the heater on, that would be even better. Um, that'll be awesome. I know my cats can stay in here without any issues, and I won't have to worry about it. Um, from that, I'm also going to be doing something with the windows, because the windows basically suck heat out. Um, that's what they do. They're, they're going to do that. Uh, I'm going to take pillow cases, um, the, like the, you know, the large king size mega pillows, and I'm just going to stuff them with R13, sew off the top, or just staple it shut, doesn't really matter, and punch some holes from the eyelets, and uh, drill, take those eyelets and put them into the, the, the old previous holes, and that's it. And I'm going to do that for all the windows. Um, except for maybe one where I'm going to have it open at all time or open whenever I need to uh, run my little buddy heater because propane can kill you and it's easy, it's better for there to be proper ventilation uh, away from you so that's what I'm going to be doing it's probably going to be the middle tier um, and that's going to be it uh, the rest of it's going to be me working on it as I go I'm probably going to finish painting uh, the front and the back um, as haphazardly as possible so that I can legally qualify um, as a as no longer a bus and then from there it doesn't it, it really doesn't matter that's where I'm at and that's how I've been and all that good stuff if you have any questions ask them below uh, if you like this, you know like if you want to see more of my stuff uh, with the schoolies specifically subscribe and uh, thanks again YouTube have a good one